Hello, it's uh, Thursday the 8th of June 2023 and uh, this is my first vlog of the month. It also marks the 114th anniversary of the film debut of Mary Pickford. On this day in 1909 uh, she appeared in two films. One was called The Violin Maker of Cremona and the other Two Memories. Thank you for listening. I always like the idea people are enjoying my vlogs. And if you are, please encourage others to subscribe and share. There are two main topics uh, this time round, uh, mainly because uh, it's all that people have wanted to comment about. Um, bullying and the uh, suggested affair of Philip Schofield with a younger man 30 years his junior. For those of you outside these shores, uh, Philip Schofield is um, a high-profile TV presenter who's excellent at his job and has been on our screens for decades. And there have been revelations that uh, uh, when he was 50, which was about 12 years ago, he had an affair with a young man who was 20 at the time. And further revelations uh, state that Philip first met this young man when he was, the young man was uh, 15 years old. And so there's the suggestion that Philip has been grooming. As a result, Philip's career is in tatters. It's in shreds and he'll probably never recover from it. He's lost all his jobs, all his sponsors, some of his friends and his agent of 35 years. As far as I'm aware, the young man in question, and his name is Matthew McGreary, hasn't said anything. So until he does, uh, I'm not going to make any comment uh, and just accept Philip's account that it was a consensual relationship and it was legal. Right, many of you have written to me to say that you feel that Schofield has been treated extremely badly by the press and that it's been an, a relentless tirade and an extreme case of bullying. Now, I have to agree, absolutely agree. It's bullying at its most extreme. And I would say it's an extreme case of homophobia. There are many examples of uh, large age gaps between adults. Joan Collins and Percy Gibbon is 32 years. Michael Douglas and Catherine Zeta Jones is 23 years. Al Pacino and Nor Falar, there are 54 years. So there's been no outcry about their relationships at all. So why should it be different for a gay couple? There is still a degree of homophobia in society, and this sort of publicity is creating more anxiety for young men and women to come out. There are many examples of younger people uh, enjoying the company of older people. And I recall when I was in my early 20s, a friend of mine, his name was John Price, he enjoyed the company of older men. And he was very concerned that when he got older, that uh, these older men would no longer be interested in him. I tried to placate him by suggesting that as he gets older, there'll be older men who like the company of older men. But it obviously didn't work. It still preyed on his mind. And very sadly, uh, John committed suicide just before his 40th birthday. For those of you who believe and enjoy the gossip of uh, Sir Philip Schofield, I think it's just a case of people making two times two makes five. And for those who say that there's no smoke without fire. I say, just stop, reflect and think. Who exactly has started this fire? Thank you again for listening. Until the next time, toodle pip.